In this video, you'll learn how to optimize your page URLs by following some simple but yet very effective SEO techniques. URL optimization is a minor SEO factor but very easy to configure. Google is good at crawling all types of URL structures, even if they are quite complex. But spending the time to make your URLs as simple as possible is a good practice. There are a couple of reasons why you should optimize your URLs. First, they are shown in the search results above the page titles. Second, they provide users and search engines a clue on what the page is all about. As stated by Google, if your URL contains relevant words, this provides users and search engines with more information about the page before visiting. To optimize your page URLs, follow these simple guidelines. Keep your URLs short and to the point. Do not include dates or other unnecessary information. Make URLs an exact match of the keywords you want the page to rank for. Let's review a couple of real examples to understand how to apply the above rules in practice. The title of a post is How to Become a Digital Marketing Consultant. By default, your CMS will create a URL that contains all words that make up the title separated by dashes. This is not bad, but it's too long to remember and contains words that are not really needed. A better version is to include only the targeted keywords in the URL. In this case, it's Digital Marketing Consultant. Now the URL is shorter, easier to remember, and an exact match of the target keyword. Another example. The title of the post is, What is the H1 tag and why it is important for SEO? By default, your CMS will create this URL. But a better version is this. This tells both users and crawlers that the page is about the H1 tag. That's it. You don't have to spend more time on URL optimization than needed. Don't forget that if you decide to change any of your existing URLs, you need to set up the relevant 301 redirects in your CMS so that you don't lose your rankings by creating dead links. This is not good for your SEO and it's bad for the user experience. 